This is Proverbs 11 and 21. The hand join in hand, the wicked shall not be unpunished. I want to start by saying all praises to Yahweh, by Shem, Yahweh Shai, by Shem, Rekakadash, double honors to the apostles and elders, much respect and salutations and blessings unto the brothers out there that's preaching this word in truth and sincerity. And salutations to the brothers and sisters that's out there listening and learning. Uh, pretty much, man, if you is like woman and, and, and you going into this route, man, you're going to be cut off, man. When, when you howl by me outside, comes back to to wreak this habit, man, you you especially getting cut off in that day, man. As you see, uh, our people want to follow the ways of the heathen, all right? Cause, cause the women, all right. Some of these women out here, they see, they see the uh, other nations. They up on high above everybody else, above the Israelites, and they pretty much want to follow, follow the way of the heathen. All right, get that money, get that check. All right, live, live lavishly. All right. So pretty much that's why Yahweh by Shimei outside is raising up his army of men to get this word out. To let you know you not to go into the way of the heathen, not to not to be out here uh, uh, dating these other heathens, man. Uh, ultimately marrying these heathens. All right, yeah, how about see me outside? It, it is a racist. He's he's against it. All right, because this woman right here, you know, if he's not a Jake, she's gonna be cut off, and, and obviously. You can tell by the pictures, really, they ain't following the laws of Yahweh by Shem Yassar, really. All right? Because, really, you don't want your woman out there in the forefront, you know, pretty much uh, uh, showing out, you know, she she pretty much got her breast out like that, man. You don't need to be out in the forefront like that. And at the end of the day, man, for all people that want to follow the ways of the heathens, you're just going to be cut off, man. So this is Proverbs 3 and 31. Envy thou not the oppressor and choose none of his ways. All right? Because most likely she's going to have some kids with this Edomite, uh, 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 Edomite devil. <laughs> and they're going to be dashed into pieces, man. And that's thus saith the Lord. That's thus saith the Bible, man. It's not out of my own words. All right? Like I said, for our people to... They want to follow the ways. Want to try to get a little come up because they down in the slums. All right, you you got your consolation on this side. All right. So this is Isaiah three and fifteen. Every one that is found shall be thrust through. Every one that is joined unto them shall fall by the sword. All right. She's gonna have our judgment. Yahweh by Shem Yashai ain't a respective person. He don't care how good you look, how, how fat your ass is. He, he don't care, man. If you ain't following the ways of Yahweh by Shem Yashai, you're going to get cut. That's, that's just simple, man. Plain and simple. That's why we making these videos warning you, all right, to turn away from your wickedness. And, and not to make marriages with these heathens, all right? You're an Israelite woman. You need to be with an Israelite man. All right? Because you're going to want that protection from the men of the Lord when Jacob trouble hit. All right? So let's get some more. Uh, verse 16. Their children also shall be dashed to pieces before their eyes. Their houses shall be spoiled and their wives ravished. All right? So she has some children with the with this uh, uh, devil right here, man. They're going to be dashed into pieces. All right? They're going to be dashed into pieces. That's the say of the Lord. That's the say of the Bible. And it's going to be a beautiful day in that day, man. When Yahweh Bashim outside gives his man that power to do so. All right? And you're going to be cut with the sword and your children are going to be dashed into pieces. All right.
And then for all the uh, uh, other nations, Edomites, all right, Mr. E, all right, their wives is going to be ravishing that day, man. Just like they took our wives, we're going to take their wives. When the Lord, all right, when the Lord gives us that power to do so, all right, it's not for you wicked ass Negroes that think uh, uh, you're able to do that now. No, it's when the Lord gives you the okay, give you that spiritual power to do so. All right. You try to do it now in, in, in this uh, uh, current society. Good luck, brother. You're going to be locked up. So this is only for the elect. Because only the elect is going to understand and, and, and going to endure to the end. All right. And for you other uh, uh, Israelites out there that want to follow the ways of the heathens, you're going to be cut, man. All right. This is Proverbs 11.4. Riches profit not in the day of wrath, but righteousness deliver it from death. All right. She's trying to get that come up, trying to get that money, man. All right. And you're going to find out at the end of the day, you're going to be cut for that. And that's all praises to Yah by Shimei outside, man. All right. And, and the only people that's going to get out of here is the righteous. All right. That's going to get beamed up in them chariots. They're going to endure to the end. Keep this word. Have that knowledge and wisdom. All right. This is Psalms 137 and 7. Remember, O Lord, the children of Edom in the day of Jerusalem, who said, raise it, raise it, even unto the foundation thereof. All right. We supposed to be. We supposed to be remembering the ways of our fathers, all right? And remembering the ways of our fathers, we're remembering our enemies, how our enemies wanted to come out and destroy us. See, that's why he's raising, that's why Yahweh Bashem Yahshua is raising up his, his army of men, all right? Raising up his nation back, all right? We understand the, that these devils ain't shit, man. They got to be destroyed. They got to be wiped off. Because they want us destroyed and wiped off the planet, man. All right. Old daughter of Babylon, who art to be the, be destroyed. That's thus say the Bible, thus say the Lord, man. Happy shall he be that rewarded thee as thou hast served us. All right. You go into the accounts, man. Maccabees and, and you know, just throughout the Bible and, and looking through history, man. Edom. He, he ain't tasted blood yet. All right. He dashed our, our children to pieces. And it's going to be our turn when the Lord gives us the okay. All right. When the Lord gives us the okay. This is what's going to happen to y'all, man. All right. Happy shall he be to take it and dash it, the little ones against the stones. You took our little ones and dashed them into pieces and, and fed them to alligators. All right, you got a you got a thing coming to you, man. You're gonna be destroyed for that, and that's all praises to you. about about me outside? All right, this is Isaiah three and thirty-two. Salakia, so Isaiah thirty-two and nine. Rise up, ye ye women that are at ease. Hear my voice, ye careless darlings. Give ear unto my speech. All right, she's a careless daughter, man. Falling after the way of the heathens, falling in love with. So-called falling in love with, with this devil, man. All right? You're a woman at ease. You're being taken care of. All right? And for all our other women that want to uh, post this and, and follow this, y'all going to be destroyed, man, if you don't come into the ways of Yahweh Hashem Yahshua or have the covering of the Lord upon you. All right? Many days, let me see. Yeah, many days and years shall ye be troubled. Ye careless women, for the vintage shall fail, and the gathering shall not come. All right, many years, many days and years, you're going to be troubled. All right, when Jacob's trouble come, all right, you at ease right now, you ain't going to be easy in that day. All right, and if you make it until the, until the Lord comes, man, you got you got a whole bunch of reckoning, man. Going to eat a missile. Gonna die by the sword of Yahweh or the or the men of the Lord. Alright. Tremble ye women that are at 
that are at ease be troubled, ye careless ones. Strip you and make you bare. Man, that's, that's deep, man. And gird slack off upon your loins. All right? So you want to be a, a, a riding... Riding with a, 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 these Edomites, man. They're going to strip you and make you bare in that day. <clears throat> so this is pretty much a quick one, man. It's understanding that you ain't supposed to be following the ways of the heathen. All right. You Israelite women. All right. Don't, don't, don't make these marriages with these heathens. Follow the ways of Yahweh outside. And, and, you know, to all the Akiyom. To all the brothers and sisters that's out there listening on it, keep this knowledge. Keep this knowledge to you close. No matter what happens, man. Keep writing your notes. Keep staying diligent. You know, keep these commandments. Even when this word ain't ain't out here anymore. Keep this word into your heart, man. Understand that keeping this word, you you still keeping your works. Alright? Storing up treasure until the end. All right, till Yahweh Hashem outside comes, and, and you reap what you sow, have them riches in the heaven. If not, you're gonna be destroyed. <laughs> if you don't keep this word. All right. So with that, I want to give all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh Hashem Yahshai, Hashem Makakadas. Double honors to the apostles and elders, and much respect to the to your brothers out there that's preaching this word. Until next time, Lord willing, Shalom.